So guys, what is up? Welcome to the first episode of BBS with Brick Retro. Brick Retro. Brick Retro. Yes, my favorite I YouTuber friend. I don't know. I think there's, and also Crypto Tattoo, but no, he's not here. So I can't. Use I'll be him. here in a few weeks though. Um, and also this mask. Um, just, yeah. Just don't don't say anything about it. Yeah. Turns out. I really need to get stronger blue. Um, so, guys, today we are reviewing Wonder Woman. Oh, and uh, this is for that video on what's it called? Oh, yes, Brick Retro Random. Do not watch that video. <laughs> so, guys, we are watching Wonder Woman. Well, not. Well, we've already seen the movie Wonder Woman. So guys, we have seen Wonder Woman, the actual movie, and we are going to do a review on that. But we are going to be watching a trailer of it and put our personal aspects into it and all that. So then we can explain better on the fact of Wonder Woman, the movie. In three, two, one. Man, people, you gotta use more noise. So, our take on the trailer was really good. It's very well designed. Um, this ending is amazing. One Woman All Together is a really good movie. Um, but the movie, let's talk about the movie. Mm -hmm. So, what was your take on the trailer first? On the trailer, it's actually the first time I've ever seen the trailer. And it's very, it's very well made. Um, uh, yeah, I actually don't really know what to say. Me too. Um, <laughs> yeah, this is my first, well, other than Spearox's review on Inquisitor, this is my first review. But, great graphics, great models, um, very well animated, uh, with the jumping sequence and all that, that, they hit the line very well. Like in some Marvel movies, they do not hide it as well, like the older ones, and also some older, uh, older like the Batman movie, when he, wait, no, not Batman, because he didn't really jump that high, but like in older Superman movies, they did not hide the string that well, and it was literally, like, you, it wasn't, it wasn't there, but it was there at the same time, so... Because you could like see the shininess of it in in the green screen, so that did mess it up some. Well, again, those not. were older movies. So yeah. Now we've got yeah. more advanced stuff. So. DC has definitely come a long way from animations, um, comics. Comics are amazing, by the way. Um, all that, but Marvel once it got bought out by Disney, <laughs> terrible. Even he knows that. That's why he became a DC fan. But, but he yep. likes. He still likes it. He, yeah. he, he watched Infinity War the other day. You mean Endgame? No, you watched Infinity War. Oh yeah, I did watch Infinity War. And he liked it. I do like the movies. It's just after Stan Lee died, they're, I know they're not going to be as good because Far From Home was the last movie he wrote that I know of. Um, he might have done like a few lyric uh, scripts here and there for other movies, and they might use them in the movie, and they might not, because Disney is not a big fan of that stuff. No offense to Disney lovers. Um, and, well, there have been some good Marvel movies, um, such as Black Panther. That was pretty good. Mm -hmm. Why am I doing this voice? Okay, anyways. <laughs> um... Infinity War, when I watched it, you know, it was, I can tell it was, you know, well made and everything, but I really just didn't care about it. Yeah, any of them. well, the thing is, he, if he does not like the movie, he will not sit down at all, but at Infinity War, we saw it outside, and we had fun with that, with the rolling tube that we were stuck in, and I, and we almost killed ourselves, but yeah, yeah. Um, other than that, we had fun. <laughs> yeah, um, and then, well, halfway through the movie, yeah. I just, like, Stop watching. Yeah, this. and then he just got up and walked away. Um, but all that was really good and all that. But one woman, let's get on back on that subject. So one woman is a design of a bird mixed with a W. As you can see, the beak is right up here where the W goes like that. It 
curves a little bit like a bird. But I never quite understood why it's a bird symbol. I never quite understood it. I think it's like the signature of the Amazons or something. But, like, in her thing, if we go back some, which I honestly have no clue where it is. I'll probably just pop up an image on the screen, like, right now! Yes. I think it's more of, like, a star or something, instead of, like, this bird symbol. I like the newer, like, I like the older Wonder Woman way better, but I do like the romance between Batman and Wonder Woman. Even he knows. I talk about it all the time. But I am a big fan of romance altogether. Um, I can say that again. <laughs> see, see. But the 3D modeling in the end is very well done. Um, as you can see, it looks 3D-ish along the sides. That looks like it's made in uh, what's called Click Team or Blender, one of the two. But it is not fully 3D. It's more 2D. T 2D. Ugh. But uh, as you can see around the edges, it looks 3D, but at the same time, it looks 2D. So that's kind of insane right there. Mm -hmm. um, but the movie itself was really good. It was one of my favorite movies for the longest time. And then Aquaman took that role, then Black Panther, and now Endgame. I will do a review on that soon, but without him because he does not like Marvel. Whoa! And games your favorite? Yes. Um, but that's that's sad, isn't it? Well, my he's not a DC fan. I am a DC fan. To be a DC fan, you need to be a Marvel fan, and to be a Marvel fan, you need to be a DC fan. Mm -hmm. Okay, I I know somebody that actually taught me that. He's been a fan of both his entire life, and he's at least seventy. And he's been collecting comics forever. But, um... I do not like like the older movies like uh, Captain America. Now, that mask was just terrible. Like, he took it off. My masks are way better, as you can see right there and right here. But we don't need to talk about the red. Um, but that mask just looked so fake. It, it wasn't even funny because in one of the parts, it slipped... And turns out that that was a blooper in one of the scenes. Uh, I think Disney made the person delete it because of it. Or something. I can't remember. But, like, they have so many bloopers in Marvel movies because people just mess up all the time. DC's way too strict for some characters. I think that's why DC movies are way better than Marvel movies. Like... Logan was the last movie for I can't think of his name. I'll pop up his name on screen, but wait for the actor who played Logan. Yeah, he left Logan because Logan and Futures Past X Men were the two movies that uh, DC made. I mean, not DC. Why do I keep on saying that? I this is better. I know it. It's is. in your mind. Um, but uh. Disney made Logan, and it is gory like nobody's business. I want to see Joker, but I'm not allowed to see it because it's too real life and not this fantasy type and all that fun stuff where it doesn't look that gory and all that. But um, his mom is saying um, about, like, you, you got to see Logan? Yes. And you're saying that it's more gory? You think it's more gory than no, Logan? No, no, no. I, I think it's less gory than Logan. I'm talking about, like, police officers trying to ban it and all that fun stuff. But they they don't want me to see it because of that reason and because it's too real life. Like, there's actual problems that people have in real life and all that. Like, Black Lightning, that has the same thing. Uh, that one's more in the middle. Like, a BBS thing, it's more in the middle. It's not really a spread thing of it. So, but back to the movie Wonder Woman. Back to the movie Wonder Woman. It was very, very good movie. Very well designed. Um, graphics amazing. Death of Steve Trevor. I can. It's very hard to believe that he's dead. But there was leaking after this movie came out and when they started Who's working. Dead? 
Oh, no, no, no. I was talking about Steve Trevor. Yeah, I know, but who's dead? Oh, no one. I said that he might not be dead in the One Woman 2 movie. Oh, I thought you meant, like, in real life. Like it. Oh, no, 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 no. Um, but some actors actually do die in, like, the movies while doing a stunt. Paul Walker. Wasn't he one of them? Yes. Fast and Furious, he was heading to a scene of because he was doing so many different things at the same time Paul Walker died. That that Fast and Furious was a good movie. Hobbs and Shaw will be the next movie I review. Um, but back to Wonder Woman. Um, it was very well designed, very well put together. Amazing storyline. Fits with the comics almost precisely. It is so specific and equals it so bet good it it grew so fast it's not even funny and deserves it because that this movie was amazing that's all i have to say for this episode but that was just amazing and soon on my other channel beautiful blast will be coming out and stay tuned on this channel for more reviews more talk about my game and how that process is coming and don't forget Special secrets coming soon about my comics that I write. Yes, I am like a smaller Stanley, but never will be. As good <laughs> Rip Stanley. I love you, man. Um sorry. Uh but I can I'll put Hats down for that. Yes. He was actually a very good man. He was a Christian. He was a Christian and he was a great man. Um but this movie was very well put together, and next movie I'll review is on, uh, off, it's either going to be Marvel or Hobbs and Shaw. I think it'll be Hobbs and Shaw. Because does it have Dwayne Johnson in it? Yes, it does. The Rock! I knew it. I have muscles just like him. Uh, where, where, I don't see him. We don't need to talk about that. I don't see it. Look at that muscle right there. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's amazing. Um, but... I will see you guys in the next video. Peace with extra BBS on the side. See and this you guys is what Micro Blaster looks like. See you guys next time. Peace.